Good morning my friends, Fabri here and today I have a huge question for you guys and I will try to answer as good as I can. In this topic I'd like to be a little bit interactive with you guys, I will explain my theory and then please tell me what you think about it and what is your own theory. We are obviously talking about Ray's lightsaber, we all saw The Force Awakens but which one she will have in episode 8? Let's start from the beginning. In episode 7 she found the lightsaber that belonged to Anakin from episode 2 and that Obi-Wan gave to Luke in episode 4. She found it in the dungeons of Mars Castle and she had a big vision of past and future. With the same lightsaber she faced Kylo Ren and defeated it in a brutal and stunning fight. Many people think that she will use it, but what I think is that she won't use that lightsaber at all. And here's why. First, because it belongs to Luke, and even if he lost it on Bespin with his hands, it's his first lightsaber. Second, because it's not in her style. And third, because, come on guys, how cool would it be to have a complete different concept lightsaber as Kylo Ren has? Of course, she could build a different single bladed lightsaber, but I see it's quite unlikely, and here is why. She always brought with herself that giant staff that used on Jakku to save BB-8 and against some troopers. And even after the battle of the Starkiller base, despite she had Luke's lightsaber she continued to carry it around. It's not comfortable at all, so why the hell she continues to carry it around? And then there are some interesting similarities to Darth Maul's double bladed lightsaber and to Mace Windows purple lightsaber. I don't know if it's just an inspiration for the design or maybe it's a suggestion to something else. Well, I see it as an hint that it could be the hilt of a new stunning lightsaber for Rey. This is why I think she will have a double bladed lightsaber. Of course, it could be like Darth Maul, but I don't think so because it's more masculine. The stuff with two blades on the sides is much more elegant in my opinion. But hey, that's just me. I think that the Staff Saber could be a nice evolution and continue to link in Race Carter because it will represent a completely new and unique solution like Ezra's or Kylo Ren's Saber. Talking about the color, I think that they will stick with either blue or green because are the most iconic colors in all the Star Wars universe. Almost everybody expects a light blue color, and I think it will be the best match with her figure, her hair and eyes, but I wouldn't be too much surprised if I saw a green blade. I don't want to divide you guys too much on this, because if she is, as I think, Luke's daughter, she could change the color from blue to green as he did in Return of the Jedi. But this could be a nice question for another video, right? Furthermore, the blue blade represents a powerful Jedi Knight, very able in combat and a brave warrior. But the green is chosen by the ones much more powerful in the force. And I think she represents the second one, don't you? But hey, that's just my theory. What about you? Do you agree or not? And which color would you like to see on Wraith Lightsaber? As always. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please take 3 seconds and go very Kylo Ren on the subscribe button for more Star Wars Episode 8 videos and to support this channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Ciao! Lions roaring in the morning sun, searching for a longer day. People feeling like the